Top 10 Most Beautiful Cities and Towns in Angola Hello Displorers, welcome to another informative video presented to you by Displor and thanks for watching. In this video we shall wander along the corridors of Angola to discover some of its most beautiful cities. Every country has its own attributes that makes it unique and sometimes only the people who live in the country understand. But some countries just have this imposing majesty which cannot be ignored, such as Angola. Angola is a country of great adventure and its cities stand as the windows to capture this beautiful southern African country's marvels. Every city in Angola presents an opportunity to discover a new side of the country, giving you a brand new perspective. Angola has a history of civil war and threats of illegal poaching, but Angola is also a reserve of natural beauties like forests and animals, and tourists come here every time to get spellbound by the scenic beauty and natural beauty that Angola beholds within itself. Tropical forests, pasture lands, historic landmarks as well as modern infrastructure are some of the many beautiful things found in Angola. This country is an excess of natural beauty surroundings and environment, with so many to peel off to enjoy the total package of tourism this beautiful country has to offer. When we speak of beautiful cities, Angola has a plethora of the most mesmerizing ones in the world, and in this video, we shall highlight some of these. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. We do understand that everyone has their own view of what a beautiful city is, depending on their perspective and general belief, but for the sake of this video, here are the top 10 most beautiful cities in Angola. Number 10. Quito Quito, formerly known as Silva Porto, is a city and municipality in central Angola and the capital of Bie province, which is notable for its cool climate due to its tropical location. The beauty of this city lies in its diverse neighborhoods, which range from very colorful ghettos to very well-planned upper-earned residential areas. The colors of the city are not only very blended, but also blinding when viewed at sunrise or sunset. Besides, its numerous luminous graceful structures and landscapes are worth the visit of every prince and princess. Its cuisine is just absolutely spectacular, both to the eyes and your delicate palates. Number 9. Kisama If you ride 70 km south from Luanda, you'll find a city named Park Nacional de Kisama, in short, Kisama. This city is only known for its national park. It is a wildlife sanctuary that has utilized stunning natural settings to protect and preserve many African wildlife species. During the Civil War years, the park was neglected and fell victim to poaching. The population of buffalo, elephants, and even sea turtles are now going strong day by day. This park even received 10 elephants by airmail from Russia in 2000. Number 8. Soyo Soyo is a city and municipality located in the province of Zer in Angola, at the mouth of the Congo River. Recently becoming the largest oil producing region in Angola with an estimation of 1.2 million barrels per day. Soyo is an important support for the offshore oil extraction and exploration, supported by an airport and a seaport with plans for a refinery in sight. The main captivating thing in your face as soon as you get to Soyo are the structures and place for its industrial activities, but a deeper look into the layers of the city will reveal an aesthetically pleasing graph of white sandy beaches with green water, natural mangrove swamps, and several captivating spots to fulfill your travel fantasies within the gates of the city. From the coastal spots with the high-rise areas in the background to the local spots, there are just endless possibilities to have the time of your life here. Number 7. Mokamides Mokamides is a city in southwestern Angola and the capital of the Nami province founded in 1840 by the Portuguese colonial administration. With a cool dry climate and desert vegetation, the city is located near the Nami Desert with red backdrops that makes it one of the most beautiful cities in Angola. Despite being well north of the Tropic of Capricorn on the Atlantic coast, the climate is subtropical due to the cooling effect of the northward flowing Benguela current causing July and August to be below 18 degrees. Even though it was an iron ore mine island in the 1960s, tourism is becoming an increasingly important industry in Mokamides. 
thanks to its rich culture and religion. The city of Mocamides is blessed with beautiful skies, great Portuguese style architectures, and luxurious parks and resorts, which have been extremely inviting throughout the years, boosting the tourism industry. Number 6. Lubango The city of Lubango is the capital of Angola's Huila province, which was established as a settlement in 1885 by Portuguese settlers from the Madeira Islands. The settlement was renamed Sa de Bandeira and development elevated it to city status. Agricultural and transportation activities propelled the city to prominence until the Civil War after it was renamed Lubango in independent Angola. Lubango is still an important agricultural center for products such as vegetables, tobacco, and fruits, but what is usually commented upon by visitors is the beauty of the city. With attractions such as Tundavala, the Christ the King statue, the Serra de Leba, and the Cathedral of St. Joseph of Lubango, the city is a gold mine of sunset and sunrise views. The city is served by a railway and an airport and has enjoyed economic growth in recent years, leading to infrastructural development, which has also been very instrumental in advancing the tourism sector by providing not only great views but top notch accommodations as well. Number 5. Malange Malange is the capital of the Malange province in Angola, located 308 kilometers east of Angola's capital Luanda. Near it are the spectacular Kalandula waterfalls, the rock formations of Pungo and Dongo, a strange stone natural rock formation formed over millions of years ago, and the Kapanda Dam. The climate is mainly humid with average temperatures between 20 and 24 degrees in an average rainfall of 900 to 130 millimeters, which is so favorable to accommodate tourists from around the world. Waterfalls, forests, and natural areas are not the only remarkable items on the menu of this beautiful rich safari destination, as adventure lovers can also go bungee jumping. Besides these, the city has an array of landmarks, such as Kangandala National Park, the tomb of Queen Anna de Souza and Zingam Bande, and the tomb of Jose de Tolado, a local Robin Hood who was exiled to Angola in the colonial days for stealing from the rich whites and distributing to the poor blacks. Number 4. Cabinda Cabinda, also known as Chioa, is a city and municipality located in the Cabinda province, an enclave of Angola. Angolan sovereignty over Cabinda is disputed by the Secessionist Republic of Cabinda, but still legally under Angola. Due to its proximity to rich oil reserves, Cabinda serves as one of Angola's main oil ports. The city and province have some exceptional spots worth visiting, such as the Mbuku Mbuadi Cemetery Houses, a long range of marvelous sculptures, the ruins of a 16th century cathedral, and the forest reserve of Kakongo to enjoy the diverse city of Cabinda. The city's population has a peculiar culture, from its way of dressing and eating to traditional rituals especially chikumbe and celebrated ceremonies of Bakamas do Chizo, a traditional ritual that enables the interaction between the living and the occult spirits of the gods, and also the ancestors, thus ensuring the reconciliation between the dead and the living. Number 3. Huambo Huambo, formerly Nova Lisboa, is the third largest city in Angola, with 11 municipalities and a population of around 1.7 million people. The climate in Huambo is tropical with a dry and cold season and a hot wet season which makes it one of the best cities to visit in Angola. Tourists come here to adventure and have exciting fun. The National Forest Reserve of Kavonge can be found in the province and is a great place for adventurers with mainly taking to the reserve for activities such as rappelling, canyoning, paragliding and canoeing. The port city of Huambo, founded on the 8th of August 1912, is industrial and has its roots in mining. Number 2. Benguela Benguela is the most loving city and best tourist destination located in Angola. It is located just near the international railways. To see the Portuguese architecture and memorable places that define the historic structure of the country, Benguela should be your first stop. With beautiful beaches and friendly people to both, this city on the Bay of Benguela is one important tourist destination to reckon with. The early economy of the city was established on mining 
and then the slave trade to Cuba and Brazil. Tourism is actively promoted in the city, and the International Railway located nearby has pushed this agenda pretty well. The main attractions of the city are its beautiful oceanside locations, coupled with the breathtaking Portuguese architecture. The beaches are fantastic places to unwind, while you chat with the most welcoming people in Africa. Number 1. Luanda We have seen so many beautiful cities in Angola that you might wonder what else the country has to offer. But mind you, this one is the creme de la creme. Luanda, the capital of Angola, is full of star contrast, one of the most famous and beautiful cities, not only in Angola, but in Africa. The views of the beautiful Atlantic Ocean are disrupted by busy ships, while the high-rise modern-looking buildings are contrasted by lean to huts. Built to accommodate people in the rapidly expanding city, Luanda certainly has its attractions and shows another side to the Africa experience in a lot of grandiose. Facing the Atlantic Ocean, there are many seaports present in this city where the ships halt, and a large population, but the charms and uniqueness of the city can never fade away. There you have it, explorers. Those were the top 10 most beautiful cities in Angola. Thanks for watching this video, and if you did enjoy the video, do all to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends.